Hi, I'm James. And I'm Jared, and we're from The Proud Company. What we have here is an automated remote control water level solution. So this is to demonstrate The Proud Company's ability to take something and from start to finish engineer everything. So we start out here with a reservoir, and inside this reservoir is some water, and there's a pump that pumps up the water through this manifold here, which we have calibrated to control and even out the input, and then a second manifold below these tanks to even out the drainage. And it pumps water into these three tanks, and we can, using our software and our algorithm, control the water level height within these pumps. And we can either just turn the pump on and have it fill them up, or you can actually automate around an inch height from the base. So the way we do it is we have these two pressure sensors that are inserted into these just custom still wells. And out of these sensors comes an analog 4 to 20 milliamp signal. And it comes into our electronics in the back, which is a MOXA IOLOGIC E1240 analog input module. And that's where the pressure sensor's input goes to. Then on the other half is an analog, or not analog, sorry, digital E1212 IO module, and that controls the pump. And together, they convert the analog signal into a Modbus bit signal, which gets sent into the other half, which is with you. So like James said, this is our software. It's a high performance data system displaying an HMI. The HMI has on, off, and automatic ma slash manual options. What the automatic manual will do, well, like he said, you can monitor, you can set the tanks to fill to a certain height and it will maintain that height. That's what the automatic and manual does. These measurements of 3.36 and 16.98 are all in inches, which is scaled linearly from the Modbus bits that we're reading in. These are real-time displays over the last minute monitoring the height of the water in the top tank and the bottom tank. So if I turn this on, you can see that the pump will turn red and it will start spinning and the pipes will turn blue, which all simulate water flow. You can also see that these tanks will fill up and drain automatically in real time. Then you can shut it off and this is a demonstration of the manual slash automatic option. This number will fill up to three inches and then it will shut off the pump automatically. You can also display this through an iPad, which is right like this. So all you have to do to display it through this is set up a simplified display because an iPad can't handle quite as much as a computer. So the iPad is more useful for people that need to be out in the field in real time monitoring their systems, being able to turn things on and off through a system like this, just in their hands, instead of having to go back to your office, make sure everything's shut off and things like that. So James is going to finish up with the conclusion. Yeah, just to say at the end, uh, this demo represents our ability to control things from what's in the field, the buckets, to electronics, to a SCADA package and an interface, controlling an algorithm. We're able to remotely access this using the, the Proud Company's network. Uh, so basically, we'll engineer the solution from start to finish, and that wraps up this demo. Thank you for watching. You can contact the Proud Company at our phone number, 412. 838-0230 if you have any questions.